I'm not going to lie to you, I kind of forgot we're in a Game 7 situation here and I don't know if I'm ready for the pressure. pressure. As soon as I loaded this up, I was sort of looking there to see what the situation is. And immediately I just kind of went... Oh dear. But you know what? It's got to be done. So let's do it. Do it! Just do it! I'm gonna go ahead and view our lines just to show you who we have at the moment. Nothing has really changed. I don't think we have injuries going on either. Okay, yeah, nothing extreme. Our first line is absolutely ridiculous. We have Berkeley playing with Matthews and Pasta. Matt Coronado, who just finds a way to get points, playing with Bedsy and Beckett. Defensively, we're quite solid as well. And then we got this guy back here, the international man of mystery. 98 overall yet can't stop a thing. Well, this is it. It's do or die, and let's hope that we do. Times eight simulation speed. And the thing is, I'm not even gonna feel safe if we have a 3-1 lead going into the third, something like that, because if I'm not mistaken, this Minnesota team has been lighting me up in the third period. So even if we do have that lead, I'm not gonna feel good. No goals after one. We're out shooting them slightly, but nothing extreme. Let's keep it going here. Come on, we have to strike first. Imagine if we have no goals going into the third. That would be even more scary. All right, come on. Come on, Chicago. Somebody score. We have Matthews, Pasta, Bedard. Somebody find the back of the net. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. Well. Let's do it. This is terrifying. 0-0, zero, zero, third period. Whoever wins goes on to round number two. We're not even talking about like the Stanley Cup final or anything here. This is literally the first round of the playoffs. And we should not be struggling against this team, but here we are. Don't you dare. That would have been an awful start. Thankfully, it didn't go in. And now we're headed back the other way. Pass the gains the line. Okay. Nice. Oh, good shot. I forgot they have Vazzy. But yeah, he's like 78 overall or something now. But like I said, doesn't really matter. Once a gamer, always a gamer. He'll find a way to make some unbelievable stops. I was so ready to sell. I was so ready. Apparently my voice wasn't ready though. Just quit on me. All right, I see you. Great job, defense. Bedsy's getting so many good opportunities here. He's got to find the back of the net. Has to. If we get shut out by a 78 overall goaltender, I don't know what to tell you, but I'm not going to be happy about it. It's just crazy to me that on paper, we definitely have the better team, and we are 20. 20 overall higher than their goaltender. And I believe he has better stats. I don't know either. All right, Kirill. Get in the oven mitt. I'm still gonna do it. Come on now. It doesn't matter if our season's on the line. No, we didn't just take a penalty. That was also like a slow motion save before that. What was up with all of that? All right, so we're gonna be down a man for two minutes. I don't like it. It was pasta too. Like, what are we doing, David? You have to be better than that. Sure. Yeah, let's go five on three. Why not, you know? Might as well. We don't want to win this game. Nice pick, Sergachev. I just feel like if we end up losing this game, you know, and this is it for Scott, it's kind of fitting. <laughs> As bad as that sounds, I feel like Scott's career was just cursed from the get. I don't have faith we're winning this. Nope, not today. Give it out to Kairou, who actually kind of managed to make that work, even though there was two Minnesota players there, so good for him. At least somebody wants to win. Through a crowd, too. All right, we need someone to get a goal. That was a big hit right in front of me too. So not only are they winning, but they're also deleting us. Insult to injury. I don't know what I'm gonna do for the rest of the video if we lose this. Like, what am I supposed to do? 
Another shot through a crowd. Saved by Scotty. And we need a goal quick. Three and a half minutes left. That was awful. 100% this team is throwing. Like, they have money on this. There's no doubt in my mind. I'm ready to be pulled. I don't know if they're going to do it or not, but I'm ready. What are we at? Under two minutes now. We've passed the two-minute warning. And here comes Minnesota. All right. Deflected aside. Back to Evans. McQueen. Another save. Another save, I believe, anyway. He might have just missed there. But I'm going to take credit for it anyway. And where is it? I don't like this. Get up, Scott! I really don't understand what this new thing is where the goalies are just on the ground, like, sort of flailing their ligaments around. Can we not do that? Unbelievable. Wow. We made a glove save. Can you guys believe that? I just, I'm playing with one hand right now. I just can't be bothered. Wow, I'm unreal. Look at this. Oh, maybe I should play with one hand more often. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. You are a disgrace. The President's Trophy curse is real. And we just experienced that firsthand. Do not ask me questions right now. James, zip it. James literally has the gall to say, we looked good all season long. Yeah. We won the President's Trophy and it wasn't close. So thanks for that. Shocking fact, James. But we ran into a better team in the playoffs? No, we didn't. We absolutely did not run into a better team. We just threw. Just adding insult to injury again. First it was Minnesota, now it's the game. Starting to see the real version of who They're interviewing me like three times a minute. No, I don't believe it. I do not believe it. Another one? Another one. Smashville goes on to win the Stanley Cup. They weren't even an all-star team this year, were they? We had two players point a game. Coronado, Bedard, and Sergachev all had five. I don't even know who this guy is, but he had four. Scott wound up with a 906 A percentage, 285 GAA. I mean, like, it's not horrible. Igor Shosturkin with a 915 save percentage. He is 88 overall, but he lost all of his abilities somehow. Tage Thompson gonna be your Conn Smythe winner, I assume anyway. Yeah, Jesper Bratt had 19 points in 17 games, but he played for Boston. So let's see here. Nashville gets back-to-back -back cups because, of course, they do. We got the President's Trophy and we're cursed by it. Prince of Wales... Columbus made it to the finals again? Scott really is cursed. Like, this is unbelievable. No, you know what? It's starting to become pretty believable at this point. So Matthews does get the art. He also gets the heart. Makar with the Norris, which, yeah. Matthews also got the Lady Bing. The Calder goes to Chubarov. They did award the Conn Smythe to Tage Thompson. Smolensky gets the Vesna and the Jennings. So, all right, that's cool. Didn't want those anyway. Bill Masterton goes to Dumba. Peterson with the Selkie. Matthews, another one and another one. Too bad we don't have a Stanley Cup, though. The draft lottery results are in, and Dallas moves from eight to one. That's crazy. I've seen this exact cutscene three or four times in the last, like, two real minutes. This is driving me nuts. Absolutely crazy. We are finally done with being bombarded. I guess we'll view the lines. I don't know what the plan here is. We have Boldy now too. Morgan Frost. The GM kind of cooked again. Shabbat and Sergachev. And then this piece of Swiss cheese back here. And once again, the mini wheats have been reset. So I must do something about this. Well, I gotta do something. So I guess we'll just play these games and I don't know what the future holds. Maybe this will be it. And we're just playing these games to kill time. Luke Hughes gets the first goal. Awesome. Let's go. Why don't you get another one, Lukey? And L. Carlson. Okay, Boldy gets his first goal. And then Kaliev gets his first goal as... No, Kaliev wasn't here last year. Was he? All righty. It is 2-2 in a regular season game that... Probably doesn't matter too much. I am a little bit torn on what I want to do after this. I just, I don't know if franchise modes are for me. I just don't like them that much. And I know that I was doing that franchise be a pro. And then it went away. And then I said, maybe 
we can still do it. But I don't know if I feel like doing it, honestly. So this is always like the worst time for me in the game's life cycle because the first Bia Pro is coming to an end. I don't know what to do without it. And, you know, I could do like a a player be a pro, maybe. Could do another goalie be a pro. I'm not sure. For some reason, I feel like I'm kind of leaning towards a player be a pro. I just haven't done one in what feels like forever. Maybe I did one last year and I just don't remember it, but I think that it would be a nice, refreshing experience because I barely ever play player. Actually, almost never. I don't play this game online. Whenever I do play NHL 24, it's for this. Blocker save. And now we've got Zaka in the corner. What are you going to do with it? He's going to give it out. And, oh, some nice passing going on here by New Jersey. That one was, like, a little bit soft. Okay. I like it. Nice shot by Boldy. Finds the back of the net. And we have ourselves a lead. Too bad we couldn't do that in the playoffs. So yeah, maybe we'll do a player be a pro. I don't think I want to do defenseman. As fun as that would be content-wise, I feel like it's just not there. Because you're not... Well, I guess you could be an offensive defenseman and kind of go up and blah, blah, blah. But no, nah, I think I'd rather be a forward. My positioning was awful there. But still managed to get the glove on it. I definitely don't think that I want to do another year of this. Just because I feel like Brett Favre at this point. I keep saying like, yeah, it's probably the last one. And then I'm like, well, we could go for one finale. And at that point, you know, it's not one finale. It's two or three. So I think we got to eventually just cut it off. And it might be time to do that. Oh! Get rinsed! They're sending us to a five on three. How nice of them. Never mind, Benzi decided he didn't want the five on three, so he's like, I'm just gonna. Oh, it's Matthews! Totally saw that wrong. A four on three, what is this, overtime? No? Get out of here. You know what? I'm gonna play the rest of this game one handed. Let's see what happens here. Let's see if we can still pull off the dub. We're up by one at the moment. All right. Ooh. Down he goes. I can still hug the post with that hand. I can move. I can not predict because I need the other hand for that. Hey. Oh, wait, no. I need to play with two hands. I just realized that right now. Can't pass it out. Not happening. In the oven mood. All right. We're going to get a little bit wacky after this game. I just had... A really good, really bad idea. Nice hit. Leveled Hughes. Okay. Ooh. Nice save by Dusty. And he misses. A wide open net. Austin Matthews, by the way. Elite sniper. Bedsy. Captain Bedsy. It's a good win. I'm doing it. The feature's back. GM request a trade. Let's see what they say. You better let me out of here. Oh, yeah, I'll shake your hand, smile, whatever. But get me out of here. I'm pretty sure that our persuasion is good from the skill tree, if I'm not mistaken. So this should work. You're a joke. Oh, wow, we started at the year 5-0. and oh. That's awesome. Can't wait to get to the playoffs and do nothing. I'm going to try simulating up to around the deadline. See if it lets me ask for a trade then. If not, we're just going to sim a whole year and see what happens without me playing a single game. Really? You're still... Coming to me about deodorant brands. We had a strong start, but we kind of fell off there, and I have had enough of you, Austin. I do feel like I'm ready to be a player, though. You know? It's been a lot of goaltending going on. I might have even done two goalie be a pros last year, so... We'll see. We are a good team again. Looking like we're on pace to win the President's Trophy, which is bad. Finally, we went one whole week without a meeting. Could it be two? Oh, go on. Make it three. This is insane. Okay. I was gonna say, three weeks would be a little extreme. Oh, actually, I guess Nashville's still really good. They are currently atop the division. Gotta be getting close to the trade deadline. Yep, there it is. I see it. I spy with my little eye. A deadline. You're facing the Dallas Stars. What's your game plan for stopping Jason Robertson? Well, my current game plan is to simulate. 
which will probably be better than me going in. We're gonna spend the day at the Boston Harbor. Yeah, I'm in for that. Now the question becomes, will it let me ask for another trait? I'm kind of thinking not, but hopefully it does. Moment of truth. We have the capitals here. We have James zipping it. And no, we cannot ask for a trade. So that's awesome. Let's get some legendary perks. How does that sound? Oh, we already have one. Ooh, insufficient funds, but I can buy the luxury yacht. Yes, please. I'm not going to bother looking at what our team did or didn't do at the deadline because I'll look at our roster before we go into the playoffs. And that's pretty much going to be the same thing. Playoff spot clenched, you know, it's just how we do over here. Management's pleased. A 50 win season. It looks like Smashville is still just barely above us. Neutral. Good thing I don't just spam my way through these all the time, because otherwise we would have had to have made a promise and I would not have been down. Do they still use Biosteel in the actual NHL? Because didn't it go under? I think they're going to have to use... I don't know, like Prime Body Armor or something like that? Oh my word, just let me get to the playoffs, please! With just zero games left in the regular season, well that is incorrect. Smashville. Oh, we lost to them, that's devastating. That could have actually done it. No, we don't have Minnesota. We do not have them. I just can't. <laughs> they named me starter, guys. Can you believe it? Sorry, just give me a minute. I've been trying so hard my whole life for this and we, we finally got it. I can't believe with the backup goaltender and everything, they gave it to us. All right, all right. View lines, what do we have here? Same thing, nothing changed, except Morgan Frost went down in overall. He was 87, right? Pasta's at 88. Holy smokes, he's really fallen off. We got the same team, so let's simulate these playoffs and see if we... Watch, we're gonna go all the way to the finals now. Two different playoffs in one video. You don't get this anywhere else. Minnesota, we're on our revenge tour. That's not a good start. Nice, I like the bounce back. Okay, oh yeah. And now, to be the best, you've gotta beat the best. And we have them right here. The Smashville Predators, bring it on. Let's go. Yes! We have the Dallas Stars in the conference final. All right, happy, nice, and easy. Come on. Oh, yeah? Oh, no? Oh, yeah? Stanley Cup final. What'd I say? What did I say? Your performance in these playoffs has been outstanding. Thanks, I know. I've been doing all kinds of crazy saves. I'm definitely doing it. And we're not simulating. Why you always lying? Just to scratch the old curiosity itch. Let's go to Stat Central because I want to see how everyone did this year. So Bedsy, 106 points. Passed the 105 and Matthews, 104. That could be top three in the league. No, probably not. But maybe. Entire? Nope. Greg Dorsett. Went sicko mode. Scott had a 920, 243. Good stuff. Aiden Hill. Did not. 44 points from Shabbat. Beautiful. First three games. You know the rules. Well, I wasn't expecting that. And we're down 3 nothing. We need a reverse sweep. And we're doing the exact same thing again. The, the team is in an impossible position. Yeah. We already lost, you know, they already won the fourth game. It's literally impossible. Words lose their meaning when you don't actually use them literally. All right, let's go just to this screen here. So we're a little bit more involved. First period, one nothing. That guy got a goal. Second period, it's 1-1. Third period? Oh, we win. All right, we're still alive. A reverse sweep in the Stanley Cup Finals would be ludicrous. Like, has that ever happened? In a seven game series, I'm dodging promises like Neo from the Matrix dodges bullets. Like I am getting out of here. Let's try this again. First period, two nothing Washington, Harley and Pavelski. Maybe related. Second period, three, three. All right, let's go times eight for this one here. Power play for the good guys. And we score. Pasta buries it. We have a lead. And after that, it's been crickets. Nothing going on in this third period. Very defensive, very shut down. Very trap until that. Washington buries it. And will they go on to win the Stanley Cup? Yeah, all right. Well, you know what? If this isn't the most fitting way to end Scott's career, other than a first round exit, I don't know what is. Like this team is really starting to develop a deep bond. And, and oh, we're just starting to develop a deep bond now, where, James? You know, really? Yeah, I love bonding with the boys over being eliminated from the playoffs, you know? It's my favorite thing. Oh, we got some hardware. Cool. Let's see what we got. 
I love how like the little the... What am I looking at right now? That is terrifying. Get me away from here. Oh my goodness, we won the Jennings. It's still there. It is still there. Leave. Oh, 32 points in 23 games. And he had 30 and we couldn't get it done. Pasta didn't really do a whole lot. Yeah, he's really falling off. Scott Sterling was a playoff failure again. 907, 301, not good enough. And defensively, not bad. Awards. Nashville Predators won the President's Trophy, but they didn't get the Stanley Cup this time. I'm only looking for our guys, and there we go. Obviously, we know we won these two. We just saw those two cursed images, and is that going to be it? Oh, we also got the Rocket. boy, Pasta. How'd you do that and then just fall off in the playoffs? Well, thank you guys for riding along this series with me, and it's been very up and down. Unfortunately, we didn't ever get a Stanley Cup, but you know what? Sometimes it be like that. So yeah, let me know what you think about a forward be a pro and we'll go from there. Unless you guys really want to see a defense be a pro. Think forward would be more entertaining though. I don't even know what to do for settings for a be a pro player wise. Because I'm so used to doing goalie ones that I have it like down to a science of how I'm going to construct the videos. No idea what I'm doing when it comes to players. Well, thank you guys again. I'll see you soon.